What's happening guys? If you're viewing the channel for the first time, welcome to the channel. This is our second trip out for 2023 Totog and we're going to do extremely well. Each trip gets better and better. You'll see as the videos come out. We have multiple fish over 8 pounds. The biggest fish, 9 pounds, 7 ounces. We're fishing Long Island Sound. If you like this content, smash that like button and consider subscribing. I'm getting good hits right away. A big key to success is using those electronics. Yes, ground is something. But if you're not seeing these fish on your down scan and the side scan, down scan and side scan combined, you can cover over 300 feet wide scans cruising over ground and covering a lot of ground to find a quality pile of fish, which is what I do most of the time when I go out. I might keep. It's close. I think it might be just female. That should keep. Yeah, she keeps. Fine, that's a good fish. On the white? Yeah. We've got some current, as you can see, from the water flowing off the boat. And we primarily fish a two hook rig setup. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Buddy. Oh, buddy, I should get the net on that. Oh, that's a nice fish, James. That might be 10, dude. <laughs> Come up, come up, it's a DD. These fish always look big on first appearance in the water. Once you get them on the deck, you start to realize they're probably a little bit smaller than what you're thinking. That's a tournament winner right there. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's about nine, it's almost close to 10. James has caught DDs all over the East Coast, but he has not caught one in New York yet, and he said I'd be the first to get him one. And it does happen in the next trip. Eight pound, 10 ounces, almost nine pounds. Nice. Almost nine pounds. It's a nice fish. Yep. This is a good fish. That good? Um. That good? I, I don't think it's. It hasn't taken any runs. It took some. It's taken drag, bro. It's a good fish. I typically keep my drag setting to the point where it's tight enough that about a six pounder will barely be able to take drag. Because once you get into those bigger class fish, if you're in structure, you don't want them getting you in the structure. They'll take the drag pretty easy at that setting. Yeah, good fish. Wow, I'm getting just wrapped, man. Yeah, they're showing up. They're showing up. 19. Oh yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Going out. It's going out. This is probably bigger than the last one, I think. I'm trying to take drag. Yeah, nice fish. Nice male. Six pounder, I think. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big male. Nice fish. Look at that one. Oh yeah. Yeah, that fish is definitely over six pounds. And that's where I like my setting. Because once you get into like nine, ten, they're going to take that drag. You get into a lot bigger, which I've hooked up with and lost because they can just peel that drag right off. Old. Nice big tug. Oh, he's 20. Yeah, nice. Dude, he's 21 and a half. Oh. Oh. This is the one. Oh, boy. Wow, I can't believe it hadn't even taken any runs yet. 
No, when they're not taking runs and they're not pulling down hard, you probably have them foul hooked, which is what I'm thinking is going on here. Sometimes those hooks get close to being in the mouth, but they're not, they're like outside the mouth and or toward the gill plate, and that's why the fish will fight funny and feel really heavy. But it's also the current. Foul hooked. Foul hooked. That's why. Keeper. Foul hooked. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, buddy. Ooh. Don't... Don't yeah, I can hear the line. It's tension on that line. It's probably like the other one. I see your leader. Ooh, this is a good fish. I mean, he's still fighting. Yeah. Where is he? Another nice one. Yeah. It's over six. It's over six pounds. Whoa. He's going sideways, bro. He's trying to go to the motor almost. Why is he going sideways? Oh, Jesus. Yeah, good fish. Good fish. Keeper. Release her. Hi, buddy. Ooh. Oh, oh, bro. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, Todd. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Oh. He's coming up easy now. He's swimming up. I don't know what he's doing. He's going to you, bro. Not a nice fish. Another nice fish. Barely had him hooked. Barely had him hooked. Dude, I barely hooked this fish. How good, bigger than the last one? It's a nice one. Yep. It's another trophy fish. You need to be careful, you'll break your shit, dude. Yeah. Anything over seven pounds, you want to get right to the deck right away because they kick around hard and they are heavy fish. They will break your leader. Another, another trophy fish. It's, a, it's over eight. It's about nine. It's about the same as the other one. Wow. That's. It's a nice fish. Dude, it's first and second place right there. Those two fish. There we go, it's back down, nice. Come on. Dude. The one duder. Ooh, dude, oh wow. Uh -oh. It's fighting hard. It's fighting real hard. Oh, I just got hit. Oh, it's a nice fish. It's taking drag. It's on a boat. That's a good fish, man. Oh, boy. Another jumbo, bro. Big male. You might. That, that one's over nine. That one's over nine. Nine pounds, seven ounces. There you go. Okay, we Take. Need to release. Oh yeah, we gotta release him. Had this been tournament day, which got postponed due to bad weather, we would have swept first, second, and third with these fish. Well over eight and a half pounds. Decent one. Big rusty one. Pale. Look at that one. Yeah. 
Another nice fish. Nothing nice ones down there. Yeah, no. 